Well, hello, and uh, thanks for taking a few minutes to just watch this video. I just wanted to take a minute or, or a, a few minutes and connect with you a little bit. It's a brand new year. I hope your new year is off to a great start. Uh, what what a blessing 2018 has been. And uh, uh, you want to make sure you're at the uh, year-end report slash quarterly business meeting coming up on the 27th. Just some really amazing things uh, to share there. But um, just want to remind you of the of the theme for this year for 2019 is Love in Action. If you were not here this past Sunday, it was the first Sunday we went to two services. And uh, so thank you for all who have helped work towards that and to serve in different ways to make that possible. But it was a, a great Sunday, and I would encourage you, if you weren't here, to go ahead and check out the um, the sermon video online so you can kind of get up to speed on the theme and some different things that uh, I was able to share this past Sunday. But the theme, Love in Action, and we look forward to seeing how we can put love in action throughout the year, uh, especially as it relates not just to one another in the church, but to the community as a whole. Secondly, uh, 1 Corinthians... I'll jump back into that series this coming Sunday. We're on the final stretch for that. And uh, that will conclude uh, on February 17th. And then I'll be starting a new series. It'll be a short series, five or six weeks, uh, called Love Like That. It takes a snapshot of how Jesus loved in certain situations and applies it to how we should love in that same manner. And that'll end on March 31st. And then we're headed straight down the road there to Easter, three weeks focusing on Easter, uh, with Easter being April 21st this year. So that's a little bit of uh, what's coming up sermon-wise. And the other thing I wanted to share with you is simply this, that Ashley LaFiles, who has been our children's director here for the past 13 years, um, it's a bittersweet thing here because she's decided to step down from that position. Um, just needs to spend some time focusing on her family, and uh, uh, a lot of things happening there as her kids are, uh, a couple of the kids out of high school and college now, one more in high school, just a lot of things going on. She needs to focus some time there. It's been 13 years. That's a long run in children's ministry, and she has done a tremendous job. I'm so thankful for her, uh, so so proud of what she's done and how she's grown over those years. It's been amazing to watch God work in her life. Uh, if you know her, you've seen that happen also. And uh, I just want to thank her. Ashley, thank you so much for all that you've done. Uh, it's been tremendous just to go through the whole process over the years. And um, so if you could, number one, let Ashley know how appreciative you are of the 13 years that she's served as our director for our children's ministry. Uh, but if you could also do a couple things. Pray for her. This is a it's a difficult transition. Uh, she's poured her heart and soul into this ministry. And it's even when it's time to leave, or you think it, you know, you sense that, and it's a good time, and you've got good things that you're leaving for. She's leaving on good terms. It's a it's a good thing. Even when it's that, it's really hard. Uh, so pray for her in that transition process. Uh, pray for the the children's ministry. Difficult process when you change the leader for a ministry. So pray for the kids, pray especially for the workers who serve in that ministry as we will be transitioning to a new director. And that's the third thing. Pray for the process of, of, of finding a new director. Um, never an easy thing, uh, but to pray that God would guide that process and work in that process and, and it would be clear for us as we walk through that process to find the new director. Um, so anyhow, just wanted to bring you up to speed on a couple of things and primarily met, let you know uh, about Ashley. Uh, once again, give God thanks and praise for her, and give her thanks and praise for what she has done here in the past 13 years. Ashley, we love you, and thank you so much, and we pray God's blessing upon you, and we look forward to what will happen in the future with the ministry as we move forward. Uh, hope you have a great rest of the week, and make sure you're here this Sunday. It's going to be a great day. Look forward to seeing you here. Bye-bye.